Hey y'all. I think I look real cute today. I'm just about to go get me a head. A head, <laughs> not some head. <laughs> My boyfriend will have a fucking fit. <laughs> But I'm just about to go get me a head so I could finish making my wig. <sighs> I already got one order to fill for tomorrow. So I'm just, I'm out here just grinding, hustling. That's all I'm doing, like, every day. Like, I ain't got no life. My life is hustle. My life is grind, like... That's all I know. That's all I can do right now. Like, sometimes I want to turn up, like, but I don't really have no friends because I don't really trust hoes like that. Every time I let a hoe get close to me, you know what I'm saying? She show me, like, she so show signs of, like, you know, uh, why we shouldn't be friends. So... Look at the ops, the ops 12. They stay posted up. They stay goddamn um they stay uh harassing me and profiling me over here. That's why I got to get the fuck from over here. Cause see and okay, I ain't even talk about that right now. But anyway, yeah, I be wanting to turn up or whatever. And um like really my nigga like I think about my nigga a lot like he's the only person that I want to turn up with because um um you know because that's my nigga and I love him my bad I got distracted I see somebody walking this nigga walking a dog <laughs> a big ass pit bull down the street that's all Look, there they go again. Look, 12 ops. They know I've been coming down here. They know my routines. I go to a few places. Grocery store, Kroger, hair store, bank, dollar store. <sighs> this shit is ridiculous. But I'm suing their ass. Yup, soon as I get ready to, I'm about to move from over here. My lease is up in July. I'm, um, I've already looked at me some attorneys. And I'm suing they ass. One of my clients, she already done told me. Ugly ass nigga, gargoyle looking ass nigga. <laughs> Milk dud head looking ass nigga. <laughs> but um, what I was about to say. Yeah, I just be thinking about my nigga. Like, I'm either hustling, taking care of my kids, or thinking about my nigga. Like, I don't really do too much. So, you know, so y'all are just watch me. Like, as I grind and just kind of like just interact with my my bambinos and you know what I'm saying I just be getting this check and then shit then I just be all in my feelings you know I, I'm all in love and shit like that so a real nigga all in their feelings and it's not a way that I turn that I don't think about my nigga like this shit is crazy yo like it's like he got me rooted or something. <laughs> um, but yeah, I think about turning up, but I can't because, you know, we're in two different places. So we'll get together soon or whatever. Like, I'm actually going to be moving. Y'all will see a little bit of me in Atlanta. And then y'all going to see me in Florida. So, you know. Y'all to see me commute, you know what I'm saying? My baby got me a camera, so you know I got the camera, I got everything, like I got the whole nine yards, so you know it is what it is, like we gonna just start, we gonna just start turning up, you know. I remember I did this shit years ago, like. When I first came out as East Ski, the street goddess, I hope this hair store open. 
Um, I remember um, I had my camera crew follow me around and it was a date in the life of the street goddess. For Trill Magazine. I never forget that. That was like, like I'm in a good place in my career right now, especially with my hair and my fashion. I, my my passion, I will all music will always be my first love. Of course, I love music. Y'all see, I'm always playing. You all, you see, I'm always playing music and shit like that. I ain't no way to park. I'm not finna park all. Oh. But um, what was I about to say? Um, yeah, I feel like I was at a peak then, you know, I was in my prime, I was in my early 20s or whatever, and, um, life was just lit, like, I ain't had not a care in the world, like, I ain't had a care, I was like, I was reckless, but I was like, when I look back and I look at my old self, I was, oh, like, damn, Ski, you were G'd out, like, I was G'd out, like, I just used to be so smooth with it, like, now... My anxiety when it comes to thinking about, you know, like all of my priorities and stuff with my businesses, like I'm always so like my anxiety is like is always like tripping. White lady almost trapped like, like she was gonna hit my car. Bitch, I was gonna get a brand new car. I got full covered ins full coverage insurance. She got me fucked up. I'ma smoke this black before I gotta get in this car. I mean, before I gotta uh go in this hair store. <coughs> but um, yeah, like I remember her following me. Kia, Kia from Trill Magazine. I remember her following me to like, um, what was it? Um, Allure. I was going to Allure Beauty Salon um, in Savannah, Georgia. Uh, shout out to Kim at Allure. She was like, she used to do my hair when I like first start performing and stuff and recording. And my shit used to be laid. And, um, um, Where else did she follow me? She followed me to the hood. You know, RIP to my auntie Boogaloo. You know, we used to be in the trap, so I'm still in the trap. But, you know, her house, we had her shit completely trapped out. Like, all of the cousins, all of the family, all of the kids, like, all of the aunties, the uncles. She followed me to the trap. She followed me to the club. I think I had a performance. I can't remember what club it was. I think it was Malone's. I think I had performed at Malone's on River Street. I had uh, performed with Bootsy. Um, yep, I danced on stage with Bootsy. I performed, opened up for Bootsy that night. I did that shit by myself. I went in there a dolo by myself, just uh, wide open. Just me by myself. I don't know where my niggas was at. Um, they wasn't with me. None of my homegirls was with me. I was by myself. Cool G'd out. <laughs> you couldn't tell us we weren't fresh in that cool G. <laughs> I had the Kooji shirt, Kooji shorts, and some fresh ass uh fruity, fruity, fruity pebble uh 90s, some maxes. And um Kim had my hair laid, uh loped out. Got down. Um so yeah, like that's when I first did my first like uh basically what I'm doing now for you guys, like um, you know, just uh, I guess trying to get more exposure you know more than i already got i already got a lot of exposure but more than i already got so um all right so i'm not going to store i couldn't really think of nothing else to say right now i'm trying to think like i got my mind that's what i'm saying about my anxiety my mind be all over the place like i be thinking of a million things right now like, I got to get my head for my hair. I got to get a lot of other stuff, too. But I don't think I'm going to go do that today because I don't really feel like it. Like, um, 